Every every hump with a rubber on is another day in hell. <laughs> <laughs> so think about that next time you put a rubber on. Dude, I haven't heard the word hump in ages. <laughs> Warning. This is a podcast done by professionals. Professional. Please do not try this at home. No. We are not priests. We I are am not a pastors. Priest. We're not priest. bishops. We're not, we're not even the Pope. Are you not? Did you not go online and get your little... You know, I, w- I went online and filled one out. I'm officially a reverend. The priests You're have a f- qualifications. A, a fish bish. Do they have, like, qualifications? No. no. <laughs> Why do you think they became... Oh, right, okay. We'll get into that in a minute. <laughs> I'm, right. just, I'm just asking. It's just a so, simple question. So after after this, question. none of the views that we say are going to be what we really believe. That's been like our entire yeah, I don't know. There really, might be a few things I do <laughs> believe, but you won't know which one it is. No, you have to okay. figure that out for yourselves. Yeah. Yeah. So, Hello, you yeah. awful, disgusting, degenerate sinners. Welcome back to the Three Skins podcast. Today, we are going to absolve all of you and your foul, devious ways. No, wait a second. We're no longer the Three Skins podcast. Oh. We are the Trinity podcast. I'm the father. I'm the I'm the son. And I am the Holy Spirit. Ooh. Amen. <laughs> I thought we were all supposed Amen. to do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah I forgot about that bit. Yeah, I forgot right. about that bit. Right, guys. Who cares? So you guys have kindly... By the way, first of all, sorry we've been away for so long. We've all been very, very busy boys. But we thought we'd make it up Extremely to you busy. by upgrading this podcast a little bit because it's been, what, like 100 episodes now of nah. us? We're in the 80? 90s. We're in the 90s. I, so. I thought we hit 100 on like the last one that we did. No, because I'll make it we a nice special one. All right, special. well, we're around that for the, kind of mark anyway. 100. But we haven't filmed one for like 12 weeks or something like that. So we decided, you know, we're going to upgrade all of this. Something Probably like longer that. than that. Probably. It's been a fucking long time. But, 13 um, now, I think. Mm. 13. But they, they don't, they actually, don't tell them that. Oh, okay. Mm. It's been a week since we last filmed the podcast. <laughs> yeah. 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 All right, guys. We love you. And from this point on, we're, we're going to be... Caring Father again? Matt, oh. Father Lewis. Yes. And Father Greg. Mm-hmm. Hello. Hello. Right. Yeah. So, um, we should we get straight today, to confessions or do you want to talk about uh, Jesus for a bit? Jesus. Yes. Jesus. We can Who was Jesus. that again? <laughs> okay. So, um, that guy... <laughs> He's pretty cool. Remind me. Who's that? <laughs> he jogged my memory. Okay, so like 2,000 years ago, maybe a little bit more. Mm-hmm. Um, Wasn't it 2023? Yeah. Something like that? That rings a bell. This Jesus guy, he came down from the sky. Jesus. No, wait, yeah. he didn't. God found a 14-year-old girl and got her pregnant. Oh, yeah. And then... How any, did, good, how any good story Greg, starts. Did the age matter? Did you have to bring that up? It does matter because I think there is a... I, well, no, don't do it. As, as <laughs> priest, Don't do it. I think there is nothing wrong with God knocking up a 14-year-old girl. That is definitely not problematic in any way. It's a good thing we did that disclaimer at the start can't, of We this. can't judge uh, past times t- as with, through a present Yeah, but lens. you think that God would have a constant moral compass throughout all ages. God can do whatever they want. Yeah, like he I can. said before, okay, yeah. who do you follow? The law or the Lord? Mm. Oh, which like one that. is more important? Yeah, the Lord. Yeah, the Lord is more important. The Lord, than yeah, the man, he's yeah. above the law. What he do you is, think's yeah. worse, prison or eternal burning? Um, hell, yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's the worst one? We don't believe in hell. Here, I reckon in, prison. In this, you know, not, not in this in this church. We don't believe in hell. No. So, so well, uh, God forgives all. So, yeah, so I how heard. do you avoid eternal? Burning? So if this upsets you, forgive us. Um, avoid eternal burning by making as many. Uh, donations to your local church as possible. They or seem the to PayPal description. Yeah, or our Holy Trinity yeah. Patreon. You can go and look at our Patreon or our. Have we still got a tip jar? Yeah, yeah we, do. Thing? we do. Tip jar so, Patreon. Go and give us money. One, one tip equals one less day in hell. Give us money and you will go to heaven. You I will. make this promise now. You if will you, go to heaven, and if you don't, then if well, you fill our tip dead. jar, we promise you that God will look. For Better on upon you, okay? Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. We're putting a, yeah. a word with the big right, man. We're doing voices. What do you mean voice, voices? I, I do voices. <laughs> only Lewis is the only one that hey actually man. do accents. Hey well, man. Well, what sort of accent oh, okay. does a priest have? Well, we, we, we I thought we were going to be. I was going to be like a hippie one, and then one of them you going to be like super. Y- you could be Irish. We do need an Irish priest. We need, an look, I- we need an Irish priest. You do we? look a little bit Irish. Well, I'm here to absolve all of your sins. Oh, he's got That's such a good... Great. It's, it's so amazing, good. It's so good it? accent. It pisses me off. That wasn't yeah. great. That was God-given. Nah, that, that was good. That was good. God-given... Um, I- I'm just going to... You know what it is? Autism. <laughs> it could be autism. I think I just have a knack for, like, 
it's I'm like a parry. You got to pick up the vibrations and the tones of of when you um, do impressions. What, what should Weird. I do then? Should I just do a posh English accent? Just be you. Hello, I think we should just there. be ourselves. We are. We are going to be ourselves. I'm not. Know? I'm not holding up a an accent this entire nah. podcast. Can I, I am... just, this is too much. Don't no. ask, Can I just it? say quickly? This is from Matthew nineteen twenty six within the Bible. How old so, were you back then? Oh, mate. Yeah, dude. Nineteen twenty six. You're looking at you looking your age though. Mm. Yeah, man. With all in with, the face. With God, all things are possible. And I wrote that in 1926. So should we get into some confessions? Yeah, let's do I, it. So As I haven't looked through them father, yet. I, I like to surprise myself. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, Matt's had a look through. Is there some nasty confessions in there? Mm, some yes. of you were devious. Some bad shit. Devious there's, there's little a lot, bastards. A lot of our listeners do not go to church. Cool. No, definitely not. All right, let me get when was the actually yeah, genuinely, genuinely I want to know when was the last time you set foot in a church? Um, because um, I not very long ago. I don't remember the last not time I was in a church. I, not, I haven't done it in a long time. Yeah, uh, I don't. I don't remember the last time I was in a church. I've been in. I've been in more abandoned churches in the last ten years than actual churches. But there is a church near us that was converted into a pub. Yep. Yeah, that is awesome. There's have you ever been to the there's a nightclub in Bournemouth? I've been there because pubs are the new churches. Mm. There's a nightclub in Bournemouth called Halo that is a is a massive really? church that's been converted into a nightclub. It's such a weird experience. I went in there, I was like, it's a good use of yeah. churches, though, isn't it? Yeah, it's a good use. Went in there, I was like 18. It's so weird seeing a bar in a church, it's still got the big window, mm. and there's a woman yeah. like breathing yeah. fire in front of it and stuff. I was like, where? That's the... cool. Hey, it was cool, that man. Cool. I liked it. It I was like a cool that. place. I mean, yeah. the church needs money, so church needs job. money, and we it's need got to fix too. its roof. Every church needs that roof fixing. Fix the church roof. Yeah. yeah. yeah we're collecting for the right. church so roof. Right, so I think everything's out of the way now. We've yeah. done enough disclaimers. Yeah, yeah, We We love you Christians. We're not Christians, but we do love you. I'm a Christian, actually. We love all of you. You believe in whatever you want to believe. Yeah, if it makes you, you happy, oh, just cr- don't shove it down other yeah, people's just throats. Just like we're about yeah. to. Okay, so I, I'm going yeah. to come out to you guys today. I, you're going you're you're to come I, out to I, us. I am a Christian now. Oh, okay. And I'll tell you why. Because the other day I was like... I did some bad shit, and I just thought to myself, like, <laughs> well, if I go, if I go into the confession box, it just doesn't count. Why would? Because as soon as you do something sl- bad, you go to the confession box, the you confess thing. your sins to the Lord, yeah. and you're absolved. You're absolved. And that is exactly what we're about to do to yeah. all of our fellow. Okay. We're about to absolve so Father all Greg, of you. Could you please mm. read out some of uh, the, right, this, let's, let's read the one disgusting, out. sinful? What did you send? All right, I'm going to start with the first one. Uh, like Greg has said in the past, rules are just something someone said and hope you abide by. Uh, that's definitely true. Uh, that is literally all morality. Rules are different everywhere you go. Uh, so. so on that note, why is it so frowned upon to fancy your cousin? Because mm. mine's a banger. Now, mm. I, I have First to or say, second cousin? He doesn't specify. Mm. And I think, personally, first cousin, even if it's the first cousin, it's okay. Because it was only until the end of the 1800s that people started frowning on it. I mean, Charles Darwin, not a Christian, mind you. No, definitely not. But he not. banged his cousin. Sinner. Dirty sinner. He had like sinner. 20 kids with his cousin. Really? 20. Yeah, but the thing is, is that it wasn't... He must have really It was like normal her. back he in the day to bang your cousin. that much. He made 20 of them. It used to be normal to bang your cousin. Are there any Darwin still knocking about? Any direct Darwin descendants? Yeah, We'd love to have prob- you on. Prob- probably like 100. Yeah. Mm. So the way I see it is that God obviously likes cousin fucking. Yeah. Because <laughs> it, if if cousins used to be allowed to get married in the church of the Lord, cousins were now, actually allowed to get married, like in yeah, a church. Yeah, I think you're still allowed to get married to your yeah. cousin. Uh, yeah. Second cousin in this country, not that I've checked. No, but it used to be mm. first cousin, and until the atheists came and ruined everything. Dumb atheists. Now we can't bang our atheists, cousins. Mate. Do you want to bang your cousins? I bet you do, because one, <laughs> one of you definitely does. Because I, I knew you'd like this too much, Greg. He, he confessed, and I'll tell you what. I confess that I don't think it's that bad of a thing. Nowadays, no, not with birth control, but as a father, as now a, a father, Matt, mm. birth control is a sin. It is a sin. So if you're going to be having sex, I was <laughs> yeah. about to say fuck, but I don't use those kinds of or words anymore. Not in sorry, the yeah. not in the sorry, not boys, in the church. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. Every every hump with a rubber on is another day in hell. <laughs> <laughs> so think about that next time you put a rubber on. Dude, I haven't heard the word hump in ages. 
hump. Oh boy, mate. I love a good hump, mate. I love a good hump. Do you right? <sighs> <laughs> that's like do you reckon on tinder you could get away with being like i'd like to hump you there's hump there's hump there's that's a way, way to find out that is good the... i forgot about hump, <laughs> hump. there's hump. hump i'm gonna hump you hump it you sounds good. so like animalistic yeah hump. like but also kind of harmless like this is a hump i want a hump because like <laughs> yeah because like i'm gonna fuck you it's hump time it's a bit it's a bit hump. harsh saying fuck but hump <sighs> It's, it's a little oh, bit, yeah. you know. Well, yeah. anyway, my child, um, you are forgiven. Yes, hundred yeah. percent forgiven. We forgive you. Just try to try to stop thinking about your cousin. No, Just don't. get her out of your mind. Humper. But if she really is that much of a bang, I mean, hang on. This person didn't specify that they were a man or a woman, did they? Yeah, it doesn't matter, does it? So it could be a it could be a woman that's interested in a male cousin, yeah. whichever gender you are of the many. Do, what do Christians believe? Do they believe there's only two genders? I don't know. Whatever you are, yeah. yeah. Do what, what are Christians' views on genders? I mm. think I think recently every, this is a rabbit hole. Happened to different things, haven't they? You got like the really like yeah. I guess they're, like they but all don't like, give a shit, do they? Loads of shit. There's know. like you got the traditionalists, and then you've got like the Catholics, you got like the hippie ones. Methodists. The, the hippie ones probably think there's like a billion. Yeah, fuck it, whatever, do whatever. Yeah, and then like the traditional, I'm the hippie one. The traditional ones are like there's only two genders created under the Lord Adam and Eve. Mm, it's Adam and Eve, I mean, not it, Adam and Steve. Fair, from a Christian, Christian <laughs> point of view, that does make sense because Adam, Eve, there wasn't Ave, the non-binary, <laughs> <laughs> the non-binary. You know Ave. what I mean? Ave, <laughs> Ave, the non-binary, the one that's just in the. <laughs> yeah, but from a Christian, can, can I have an apple? Fuck off. But yeah, from, <laughs> a, from a Christian point of view, Ave. I guess it does make sense that there's two genders. <laughs> They yeah, weren't even, a, yeah, weren't even written about. View, it they sense. were there, but they I just mean, weren't in we, the book. We, we as Christians, mm. yeah, mm-hmm. Adam and Eve. Mm-hmm. Uh, were you all christened, by the way? Were you christened? I was christened. Were yeah, you christened? I was, yeah, I was christened. Same. Yeah. 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 It was quite a normal thing back in the 90s, wasn't I mean, it? Yeah. Was wasn't it something to do with, like, I'm sure my mum said something like it was because it helped you get into... They kind yeah, of school and stuff. Certain school yeah. or something? They kind of, like, shamed kids that weren't. We uh we went to Catholic school and our mum lied about us having the communion. Yeah, <laughs> I didn't know that. That did not. I didn't know that she yeah. lied about. Yeah, mum just straight up. They were like, "Oh, have they had their first communion?" And she's like, "Yeah." Lying is wrong, but your sinner of a mother is forgiven. Yeah. And then we like, forgive her. her. And then like, she did it for the greater good. She got like uh, birth records of uh, a grandpa to prove that he was like born Catholic or something yeah. as well. Yeah, they have to do that. Yeah, don't they? it's anyway, so it's so weird. So we what was we we resolved this person. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Can we get on to the next one, please? Yeah, could you, could you do another one, I'll Father do, Greg, do please? Um, Go on, just rattle off a few, and then I'll get... Um, it's so weird. How long have we been talking about... Sorry to interrupt. How long have we been talking about getting an uh, actual setup? I know, it's mad, isn't yeah, it? This Five is, years. This isn't an actual setup. Though. I kind of it's, feel it's, like... It's better, we're it's nearly quali- done. It's better quality. Yeah. Well, it might not come out better quality. This might we'll find out. Yeah. It sound terrible. If it, so, apologies in advance if this sounds terrible. We're, we're still we'll working on it. We're still getting used to it. But if it does sound terrible... It's um, because the Lord has decided yeah. that's the way it should be. Right and then. maybe we have further learning to do. Come on, here's us with on another to one. The, uh, next confession. Come on then, Father Greg. So when I was in year one, mm-hmm. I broke my own glasses on purpose and then I blamed it on another kid. <sighs> that poor kid. Damn. That is a lot of that's a lot of sins. It's a multiple levels into of the one. Sin. There's mul- there's la- that that is an onion lay onion layered yeah, sin. It is, isn't it? That's multiple sins. You've you've broken, you've lied, and you've let someone else take the rap yeah. for your and wrongdoings. You've got to think his parents probably paid a lot of money. For they could glasses. have been expensive glasses, you know. Yeah. They could have been <sighs> I, I do I, think children get glasses for free. I can't remember. Yeah, but this could have been back in the day. Yeah, this His bloke parents, could be like his parents 50. probably worked in a mine for like f- five years to afford they, those yeah. glasses. Why do, you, why do you think everyone w- li- like worked in a mine? I think that, that a lot of our viewers are Northerners, because Southerners, yeah. Southerners have really shit sense of humour, and Norm- Northerners have a good sense of humour. Yeah, they, I'll they agree with you. So on we, that. we do have a lot shit. of North. I think we have a lot of Northern fans, Scottish fans. Maybe. Yeah, probably those. You are all a laugh, you lot. Northern Southerners like are so orphan. boring. Mm. So I do hate you lot. You are all like. Dirty and smelly. Yeah, you, you, yeah, but, um, cold lung. So you broke this lad's glass. You broke your own glasses. Blame this other lad. Um, 
I'm assuming, by the way, that you confess that you never actually apologised to this other nipper. Yeah. And you let him live with that. And um, so that is a that is a multi-layered sin. I think the best thing for you here to do would be, are you sorry? If you are sorry, then the Lord shall forgive. But also donate to our Patreon. And <laughs> yeah. then that, I think, will get you the extra I, foot I think with a, in the door. With a certain amount of the money given gates. to us, we can forgive you. Yes, yes. I can't really forgive a person that's not willing to financially no. support. Confession is the me. first step. It's just the first step. Yeah. The rest comes later with hard cash. So yeah. Yeah, I think I think that's pretty clear cut. That's pretty clear cut. You're half forgiven for now. I think but we should, yeah. Maybe we should try another confession. I think we should move on, Father Greg. All right. Hit us with another one. Once when I was a kid, I was scared of getting locked inside of a toilet cubicle. <laughs> so I went into the woods, climbed a tree, sat on a branch and pooed out of the tree. Now I've pooed out of a tree several times, so I don't think that is this is quite a. Uh... I've pooed out of a tree too. I actually filmed it and put it on YouTube. I feel yeah, left out. Did, I've never. Did, I'm yeah. the only one here that hasn't shit out of a tree. You never shit out of a tree. No, nah, I've I've pooed in pup in in you know out in yeah. the in the woods in the wilderness and things. One thing I thought. Never when, out of a tree. When I pooed out of a tree, the one thing I thought was, this is the, <laughs> this is surely the way we're meant to poo. Because the thing is, is that your legs, your 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 butt sort of distends down a bit. Your legs are up. Yeah. And the poo comes out. You don't even need to wipe. You know what? I don't think there's anything to be forgiven here. You know, no. I think you're just going back to Natural. roots. Yeah. You're going back to how Adam, the world yeah. should be. Adam and Eve probably showered. They would have been shitting out of that apple tree. They would have. You know, that's why that apple was tainted. Yeah. Because that's why God said, don't, it's probably how don't they got eat to the apples. from the tree, that because we all poo yeah. out of that. Don't eat them apples. Those apples are ruined. Those are bad apples. And uh, But you're not a bad apple. No. You are, you you know, I think the, the poo tree, you know, yeah, you're just going back to, that's grassroots. Yeah. That's you, grassroots. You know. That is, that's the way we were meant to live. Mm. But if it makes you feel better, child, you are forgiven. Yeah, you're forgiven. And, you know, there you go. Next one. Sometimes I jerk off upside down because it's the only way I can chum. I think that chum. Means, that's that's a spelling error. It must chum. Be. Unless they mean I empty my chum bucket. They chum ejaculate into their mouth. It might mm. be like now, a bat. That yeah, that is where this. If you're just well, actually, isn't all masturbating a sin? I'm pretty sure it is, Father Father Lewis. Hmm. Shouldn't be touching yourself. No, it, wait at a all. minute. It's a sin. The, 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 the best <laughs> it's way to a know Sam. It's, the way I know it's a sin is because chimpanzees do it. If a yeah. chimpanzee does it, you, you ain't, you're not an animal. You were created by God. We've all seen those videos. They go at it furiously, like they're trying to, like they're trying to rip it off. Yeah. Like, do you reckon they've ever done that? <laughs> we should not be talking about animal penises. Why not? Under the house of God. Oh, mm. yeah, that's true, yeah. I mm. don't think God's... No, God created animal penises. <laughs> he has yeah. no issue with them. It's <laughs> so tricky because, yeah, like, all things, you know, we're supposed to question this and that, but isn't it all his will? Yeah. So, like, oh, I'm confused. I shouldn't be judging or questioning anything, should I? Yeah, surely, like, everything's part of his plan. So yeah. So why, why are you talking shit about it? You talking shit about God's plan? You got a problem with God? I didn't say that. No. I'm, I'm sorry. just saying, man. Please, please. Mm. I have an issue with you having an issue with God. Mm. But my child, um, the problem is not you, upside down or whatever way that you are. No, it's the direction cut, yeah. you're squirting your jizz. It's more the fact that you're touching yourself in you, general. You need to find yourself a girl to have missionary yes. sex with purely for reproductive purposes. Once you are married. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Put a ring on it first. Yeah. Put a ring on it. Yes. But not on your dick, because a rubber on your dick that is a sin. The Pope said that. Mul I, multiple Popes. Father Greg, yeah. I I must confess, what? I do not believe that that is a sin. That is... Birth well, control is okay. No, you it's know not. What? Listen, no, it's someone over not. here didn't pass their reverend exam. There is nothing Type. good about rubbers. Listen, I follow the Pope. Rudders. He, told, he said for ages and ages <laughs> to the African people, don't worry about AIDS. Yeah, he did say that. But then, well, it seems to be going all right from so far. Then, then they changed, and now the new pope says, "Yes, use birth control." So you don't yeah, but this new pope's AIDS. a little dickhead. He's hey. fucking. He is destroying the Catholic Church. The Catholic Church back in the day was amazing. Fire, brimstone, hell, cut your penis off. 
I don't know what I don't know. I guess that's what the Catholic did, and, and we did a lot of Something things. Like that. The Catholic Church used to do a lot of things, a lot, a of, lot things. of crazy shit. And now we can't do anything because this stupid little hippies are like, "Eh, hey, you gotta love your neighbor." And they like, the fuck up. Jesus didn't say that. Jesus said, "Fuck your neighbor." I'm gonna fuck him up if he's not no, Christian. No, he says, "Love thy neighbor." No, he says, "Love thy neighbor," but unless he's Turkish. <laughs> In which case, <laughs> kill a <the> bastard. <laughs> but you know what I mean, like. Like back in the day, Christianity used to be amazing. You, we had swords. We would go around cutting people's heads off. We were like burning people alive. The Crusades now, were now mm. disgusting. Like, now, Father Greg. Yeah, but Christianity is a joke now. It's a joke, and I've had enough of it. I've had enough of being a joke. I've had enough of you know walking around with my fucking like little thing, and everyone looks pointing me going, "Ha ha, pedo." It's like, you know, how dare you? All right, how dare? You? Okay, yeah, quite a lot of quite a lot of us in the church <laughs> oh. did do that, but. But Fuck it now. back in the day, we would have killed that guy for saying that. Uh, it took 25 minutes to yeah, bring up pedos. <laughs> no, but no, <laughs> yeah. Jeez. I just, no, look, all I'm saying We is can't that brush that stuff under the carpet, though. That a lot of that it happened. Did, it did happen. Wait, what yeah, was the confession even uh, about again? Matey shit out of a... No, matey jizzed upside down. Yeah. That's what, wrong. So you think that's Don't wrong do that. purely on the basis of masturbation? Yeah, yeah. yeah Not yeah. the fact that he's... Chumming on his own. Never no, masturbate no, in vain, ma- no. Father Matt. There's a lot of veins when I masturbate. <laughs> you can masturbate, but only if near the end you put it inside your wife and <laughs> <laughs> you finish off inside yeah. her. That's the only time you're allowed to masturbate. <laughs> oh, God. For reproductive purposes only. <laughs> yes. Make more of us. If there's Boy. one thing that the church can teach us, is that there's not enough human beings on this planet. Yeah. We need more. Make more. I was thinking about this. Sorry to step outside of the whole thing. I was thinking about this the other day. Surely, now that everyone's, you know, having abortions and... Don't say the A word, Matt. That's a I'm a Father Matthew. Thing. I've had enough of it. All right. It's just an abo- I'm just the word. I'm, I not, think... I'm not... I've never forced someone to have an abortion. I've never had an abortion myself. Yeah. I'm just using the word. Don't mm. cry about it. I'm just saying that abortion, that is a pretty touchy subject at the moment. And I have to say, as a Catholic, it's, it's co- I'm not a big fan. <laughs> I and I, I, I'll say one thing, all right? <laughs> killing kids, say something? Killing kids is not cool. And I'll tell you what, everyone's always like, oh, they're going to belong in orphanages. Yeah, but there's loads of Catholic orphanages. You can bring them to us. <laughs> no, <laughs> don't ever do that. Yeah, back, brought up in a Catholic back in the day, I... yeah, back in the day, it used to be like every orphanage used yeah. to be like... But, uh, christian didn't they? The, the thing is is I, it, back to like a serious point i really think that the future may be religious because uh, why because it will get so bonkers to the point where people no, revert back no, to no, no, faith no, no, no. well maybe that there is a decent basis of living there's a lot of kinks that need to be sorted out but it's just like kinks that's another be nice wrong one. be nice to people and be a good person that's, that's mm. essentially what like, if you boil it really down but this, this is what I was going to say I think because of a, I could be wrong it, it, we, we probably but say around. it anyway you're all wrong it's just a thought I, I haven't looked into it I don't know the truth whatever but there's so many people having abortions and you know uh, birth control Johnny's the pill yeah the coil yeah mm-hmm. they're all well a large majority of them are atheist so in the future they're breathing That's a true. lot of Christians and a lot of Muslims. But there's one one argument against it is that a lot of religion is generational. Yeah, but yeah, but a lot of atheists so atheists are like Yeah, but nah. a lot a lot of atheists don't come from atheist families. They're they gonna come kill from, themselves. They come from religious families. Yeah, because you rebel, don't you? Yeah, it's like rebellion. You do, but it is increasing Irreligions like increases, increases. In, but ki- in, but in atheist England, people aren't having kids. Yeah, but it's not about having kids, because like there's, there's loads of ex-Muslims, there's loads of ex-Christians. It's because they get raised with it and then they rebel. And you live, a, we live in a modern society. Every, even the most religious kid has access to the internet. All right, and it don't take long to realize mm. that well, the, the, the stuff that we, the, the stuff we preach becoming is becoming incredibly edited now. Yeah, but the the thing is, is that wait it, until AI God mate. It doesn't take yeah. long to look. We're gonna at do it. a chat beat GBT. Um, it doesn't podcast. take long to look at what we believe in, and think that's a bit dumb. Mm. It is a bit dumb, isn't it? Anyway, should I mean, we do some, some more zombie dudes? Should we do some more confessions, That's Father cool. Greg? I love it. Zombies. Is cool. It is zombie cool. Jesus is the it best. Is cool. Zombie Demon Jesus. Demon flu. Yeah. Black, black, part of black. Right, that, that's no, you don't know. You're destroying the mic, man. You're gonna blow up the. Oh, it makes him 
Oh, that's a little bit bad. Go on then. So, Sorry, he's got the yeah, skateboard. we're going to move on. We're going to move on, all right? So, we, we spent a little bit too much talking about coming and chumming. Mm. So, chumming, come. Um, we are going to move on. Bucket. Yeah, stop chumming. Now, this one is quite a serious one. They've all been quite serious, yes, have they they've not? been incredibly serious so far. No, well, I would like to see my fellow father's views on this one. <laughs> so, the father's communion. When I was young, I yes, used to catch no. fish. <laughs> Already stop. Already. We... Just to beat them to death with a tenderizing mallet. <laughs> tenderizing mallet. Hey, now, it way, <laughs> it's... If he ate it, that's okay. Yes. Well, I, the, the thing is, is that it's a bit... The thing about Christianity is that we believe that consciousness is divinely granted by God. All right. So we have consciousness because of dualism. Like God puts consciousness into our heads. It doesn't come from our brains. Now, he doesn't do that for fish. So fish don't technically feel anything. So bashing them with a tenderizing mallet actually ain't that bad. I like this. I like this. You've, you've, you've dissected that very nicely there. If you're going to eat it. Yeah. I've, I've no, 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 no. He just, didn't say just anything for fun. about eating just them, for, even, even doing it for, just for fun. Just for fun. Did just Jesus fun. not have a thing about fish, though? Well, the the, 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 the famous uh, fish. He didn't like people Jesus eating... Jesus inside it. Have you seen that? Yeah, yeah, that's quite... A no, but I know all the Jesus it's people have that fish yeah, on the, the fish. back that's, of the... It's, yeah, yeah. it's to do with Jesus, yeah. I, but think, he, um... I know he had something about shrimp. I'm sure it says it, in the Bible. Oh, it, it, yeah, yeah. So yeah. In, in it says Le- in the Bible loads of times, it, like don't eat. In shrimp. Leviticus, uh, you're not allowed to eat shellfish. So the issue with that, though, is that there's a. I think it might actually be a vicar. The, 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 well, the issue you with the much. issue with Leviticus is that it's Old Testament, and when Jesus came, he brought the new rules. <laughs> ding, 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 ding. Now the new rules <laughs> were a bit different, right? He yeah. like cause you used to not be able to wear clothes of different fabrics. But look at us. We're wearing different fabrics. And I'll tell you one thing. Jesus came and he was like, God damn, you can wear denim and you can wear cotton. I don't give a shit. You just got to love each other. I also think that Jesus, um, not Jesus, but God said that you can't have tattoos. When did he say that? You've got, you guys got tattoos. I ain't got tattoos. Please remove them. I ain't got no tattoos. I have man. a singular tattoo that was after a drunk Are you allowed night. tattoos? I don't think you're allowed to. Make so no, you're not. You're not so allowed to. Tattoos. You're not allowed to modify your body, are you? As yeah. as it is a temple, or at least. So you're not I, allowed to get your court foreskin cut off. But what counts as body modification? Like, what about a haircut? <laughs> that's yeah, a funny, that's Maybe. a funny point. Do you it's, know what I mean? I don't agree with it, but that's a, uh, it's a funny point. I'll give you that. What about getting like a pacemaker? <laughs> <laughs> hell, a you're going to hell. Uh, or like yeah, a fake leg. Off. <laughs> I, I'm, 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 I'm starting to have a few issues with this Bible. There are no lepers in heaven. There's a few things I didn't think about until now. After my 30 years yeah. of being a Christian yeah. and, and yeah. a vicar. Yeah, I've, yeah. Uh, Funny, I've it only issues. took a half an hour chat for us to start yeah. picking away at the holes. This is a few, few problems. Isn't yeah, it? I'm, I'm Couple. sure it says do not make. It, it, or if it's not that, it's do not make markings of. Me on your body. Okay. Oh, well, I don't have any of those. I think don't it might worry. Be that. It might be like things like so crosses and all of those people oh. with like religious tattoos. Oh, dude. Yeah. Is that Show Lewis? Uh, Greg, sorry. Show Lewis. Oh, mate. There you, yeah, go. mate you can get out of We're it. We're going to have mate. to cut that out, though, because I don't want any of the of the of our fo- devout followers to know about my wrongdoings. Uh, you oh, that's another rule, by the way. Sorry, we forgot to say that's another rule. If you are a father or a reverend, you're just automatically forgiven for all. That's just how it works. Don't ask why. Yeah, 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 yeah. We, we, yeah. we can do anything. We don't make the rules. <laughs> that is why. why do, that's why probably why we've had so many issues. Why do you think we love being vicars? Yeah. You can do whatever the fuck so I can do whatever I like. Do you think that's why there's been so many issues with vicars in the past? What, because they think that they've got God on their side so they can just yeah. do whatever they want? Yeah. Probably. I'd love to talk to, like, one of those really bad vicars and just like i want to pe- pick pick up their brain because it's like do they legitimately breathe in christianity but still did all of that you know what i mean mm. well if if i told you if you were an atheist if i told you you can do what you want so long as you say sorry to god at the end at the end it makes it okay again and you know that you get a relief of yeah you know, i don't have to worry about mur- murdering people because i'm still going to go to heaven don't you think that's a little bit odd? Like, mm. yeah. but that's why all from... that's why all old sick people think... all turned yeah. all suddenly yeah. discover faith. 
They, they do. For me, it's faith like, comes from fear. Yeah, they it, do. it does scare me sometimes no, that not, there's people out always. there that are happen. only not murdering and raping because of God. It's like imagine if they suddenly oh. stop believing. Maybe man. those people do need religion. They probably do need religion. We we so need religion keep to keep those guys yeah, like keep sane. Going. I think it's, it's different bad, in America and and like the UK, isn't it? I'm not saying that the UK is perfect. It's definitely not far from it. But I think we sort of tend to have. Like you say, isn't it like only 25, 30% of the UK are even like religious or at least Christian? It's anyway, gone, it's gone yeah. down a lot. Yeah. yeah. Down a lot, Whereas yeah. America, that's a, it's a very different, mm. you know, yeah, if you're they, brought they up in a it. little rural, small town community with the local church and blah, blah, blah you're going to, that's going to be a big part of your life. E- e- yeah. Even, even the consensus isn't accurate because there are people out there that will go, yeah, I'm Christian. They don't go to church. They don't yeah. read the Bible. They don't. Yeah. yeah. They think yeah. it means you're a good person if you put Christian. Yeah. yeah. To the, to or them, generational Chris... again. Like going yeah. back to that. Like, I think my mum's a... Jewish. Oh, well, I guess Jewish is a race. My mum's Christian, therefore. Yeah. I'm Christian. I think a lot of Christians mm. is so a lot like of people don't really think about it, but until all that Christianity is that. to them is I think there's something else, something above me. Like yeah, there a, is. Like a god. There is. And then they. That's it. Oh, and I'm a good person. That, that's literally all Christianity is to them. And that's kind of like lame because it has nothing to do with Christianity. Right, let's sin. Go, let's they, go back they, to they, it being fathers. They, 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 could, they could be a Muslim or something Father. like that. There's nothing Christian about that. Fathers. Father Lewis. Father anyway, Jake. Go on. You get some, would, what was the answer to the bashing a, so a fish with? What I said is... As long as he ate it, it's cool. Yeah, no, no. Fish don't have consciousness according to Christianity. Oh, so yeah. It's fine to torture them. Yeah. Torture, oh, okay. torture as many let's fishes. Torture I, I, the fish. I, I honestly cannot see how a, a Christian could argue against that. And I would love to see a Christian argue against that because you literally can't. Oh, they will. You cannot argue against that. You, but... In Christianity, you can torture animals and it's fine because they don't have consciousness. And if they don't have consciousness, they have no feelings or thoughts. I'm no, I'm noticing a trend with these confessions as I'm looking through them. They're all from when people were children. Yeah, yeah. They're all, all every single one of that I've just clicked on starts with when I was a kid. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. They've been holding on all, to it for, yeah. for that. You that guys long have been holding on to this lives. shit for a long time, and I'm glad you're here yeah. to well, share we this. We can stuff absolve you today. I, do you want me to read the next one do, out quickly? Just quickly, do we absolve the fish basher? Yeah, I think so. In the eyes of the Lord. Like you say, um, God gave fish very small little brains. And yeah. they can't comprehend. So bash them up with a meat tenderizer. Do what you like. Oh, you're absolved. Do what you like with the fish, you're absolved. When I was six, this kid Kyle <laughs> tried to trip me up and broke my nose because my face hit the wall. I went to get him back a few weeks later till I realised I tripped up the wrong person. And it was actually my mate's younger sister who apparently... Looked alike from behind. So what you're saying is they tried to get that someone back, got the wrong person. Um, I'm guessing so. Hang sounds on. like an honest mistake. It's to an me. honest mistake. Yeah. Tri- he tri- a kid tripped him up and broke his nose, so he got him back, tripped up somebody, but it was actually his friend's it was sister. Else. Oh, so, it's the sister of a friend. That's even worse. So get, getting revenge is cool because an eye for an eye. That's God. Is that God's way, an eye for an eye? An eye for yeah. an eye and the whole world goes blind. No, that's Gandhi. That's Gandhi. Stupid little Hindu. Oh, <laughs> great. <laughs> they ain't <laughs> Christian. <laughs> yeah, you know, he's right, though. Yeah. No, he's not right, because in the Bible it says an eye for an eye, um, an ear for an ear. Um, tough for a tough. Someone fucks you up, you fuck them back up. Mm. Oh, is that in the Bible, is it? Well, no. Mm. But... What version but... of the Bible is that? St. James? Uh, yeah, well, uh, look. At the end of the day, I'm I'm par- paraphrasing, all right. I'm oh, okay. I'm not yeah. saying the actual. You're modernising. Yeah. You're using modern speech. Yeah, to, yeah. I'm trying to I'm trying to help people. Past scripture. That's what makes a good reverend. You've got to you know, get on people's level. You've got to levels. translate it. You've got yeah. to translate the, the holy documents. The... It's God's word through your yeah. mouth. Yeah. Yeah. You know, like the Holy Spirit just <laughs> incoming <comes> in. transmission. <laughs> incoming <laughs> transmission. <laughs> Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> Hey, wait, so <laughs> what do we think about this? I, as Father Matt, mm. would say, honest mistake, it's a shame it's your sister. I hope you apologised to both your yeah. friend and your sister. And You seem quite conflicted. So. I I will absolve you. Yeah, mm. I think The fact that you even yeah. still remember that, you obviously feel yeah. Regret. yeah, yeah. you're absolved. Yeah, he's yeah. absolved. Yeah. Regret is important because it, it, it shows acknowledgement. Mm. Yeah. And you are forgiven, my you child. Forgiven. You're definitely forgiven for that. But you're also 
I just I just glanced over at what was on Greg's phone and all the only words I saw were accidentally killed. <laughs> oh, so I'll say how <laughs> Go on. They were the only words I saw. It. Accidentally killed my aunt's dog and never told anyone. <laughs> oh. He told us. See, there's not enough yeah. details there, but he, said, he does say he does say accidentally. Mm. Yeah, there aren't enough details, but yeah, the the word accidentally is is but a this, key point there. This comes back to the tenderized mallet. Yep. So, it's a dog. Mm, small brain. So, yeah, as long as you eat small it. You could have acci- yeah. yeah, you could have accidentally killed it. You could have intentionally killed it. You could have killed it with a tenderizing matter. It doesn't matter because it doesn't have a consciousness, according to God. So Is I that don't... the new or the old? I don't know. I'm pretty sure that is what Christians believe, that consciousness Cause if... is something that God gave to humans. What do you mean, humans. Christians? You're a Christian, aren't you? I, I'm pretty sure from what I've read of the theolo- scripture. theology and scripture, that is true. So you can kill dogs, and it's not. A well, we don't have enough information about this. No, how we can don't. you we accidentally don't. kill a dog? I've, I've. <laughs> I, I think I, 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 I can is. see several. Circumstances. I think it would be yeah. quite hard to purposely kill a dog, let alone maybe, accidentally. Maybe you accidentally gave it chocolate and didn't know you can't give it chocolate. Depends what kind of chocolate. dog that we're talking. Yeah. Like yeah. an Alsatian, with your bare hands. Big boys. Aren't tough. They? Yeah. A Chihuahua. Dude, I could eat a chihuahua. A fucking, so I would Gerard free kick that thing. I have, I have, I have a space. friend that has a... What's it, <laughs> laces, what's it called? <laughs> uh, a Pomeranian, I think. Oh, yeah, a tiny little yet. fluffy thing. And, and a little fucking shit bit my ankle, yeah. <laughs> Just because I walked past it when it was eaten. When? When's this? Like six months ago or so. Really? You never said anything about yeah, this? Yeah, and, and it, Greg it, it hates didn't, dogs, it didn't like proper Father bite, but like it, it, drew, it drew first blood, you know what I mean? It, I, and I mean, the, I had to fight the temptation to kick the living shit out of that dog. But well, as a Christian, you can because if you yeah, say, "Yeah, I'm allowed to," I'm allowed to. I yeah. trust you. You're probably the smartest of the fathers. Yeah. You've read the most scripture. I mean, if that's what you believe, that's what you take from I'm it. Then God, sure, pretty sure, doesn't give animals thoughts and feelings. No. You should have kicked it. Yeah. The thing is, is that right up the ass. I didn't want to. I don't want to really upset are. my friend, which would have obviously complicated the relationship if I did kick it. Okay, so should we say that it's probably God's doing that you're only allowed to kill stray yeah. dogs? <laughs> well, no, I think... I think Ones that have owners, you'll make the owners sad, but stray think, dogs are up, up for you? grabs. It bit me up my ankle. Why? Just because I walked past it when it was eaten. Apparently it's really territorial. But it's food. small dogs, man. I didn't know. I didn't well, know. Then, it's small dogs. Uh, it, mate, is it like Scrappy uh, Doo? The thing is, though, imagine that was like a fucking Great Dane, yeah? Put down. Yeah. Put down. But because it's a little bitch dog, ain't getting put down, is it? My my, I got a little dog and it bit the postman once. Ooh. And we, we ended up getting put on one of them like watch alert things. You know what I mean? They're like, oh, all really? the postmen have the to be like, there's a dangerous dog this in this house. Blacklisted. Yeah. Never knock the door on this one. Yeah, yeah. I oh. I remember knocking the door on your house, and it they go ballistic. Yeah, they go nuts. It, it's I would never knock your house door again. No, I will always it's... ring you. When and I'm we've outside. got like a gravel path, and they yeah. hear the crunching. Are you, <laughs> are you not able to like train dogs to stop doing that? Yeah, you can, it's but funny. it's like Why don't you train it to stop well, no, because I got two dogs, when and one friend... of them's very old, and the other, the young one, learnt from the old one, and oh, the old okay. one is just there's no training that dog. He's a why didn't bastard. your friend teach your dog not to bite their friend, your friend? Because he doesn't train that dog, and small dogs are hard to train. They're just so sh- just pieces of shit. Maybe the dog was just an atheist. He could have been mm. sinful. Mm. The dog. Well, well why are we? To... I'm thinking about. Wait, wait. Let's go back to the aunt's dog. Yeah, yeah. It was an accident. If it was an accident, I would say yeah. you're forgiven if it is an accident. But you're not. I think you should tell them. I, yeah. I don't. If think you, you didn't should tell them. your aunt, then that's, I think you're going to yeah. complicate your relationship with your aunt over a dumb dog that doesn't have thoughts and feelings. Ignorance, so. ignor- ignorance is bliss. Maybe it's better to just leave your yeah, aunt. I, in. You don't want to bring up you, all those thoughts should, again. If, if you do yeah. kill a dog accidentally in the future, I would confess immediately. Yeah. Yeah. Certainly. But. Maybe I'll go back on what I said. So should we all agree? Just you're you're fine. You're just don't kill any more dogs. No more dogs. Just no more dogs. Just, just stay away from dogs. It. Fish and mallets. You're fine. Don't kill any more of your family members' dogs. What does this show about our viewers? That fucking animal killers. Yeah, and there's a lot of uh, deviance mm. that. Watch there's a lot of dogs. sexual deviancy as well. It's just yes. jizz and jizz shit and animal killings. Yeah. yeah, here we go. I'll just I'll just pump out another one. 
Sometimes when I jack off, I let the cum dry on my belly and then wait for it to dry so I can peel it off like dry glue. That sounds satisfactory. It does sound very satisfying. I've never tried it. No, you see, it. that's the worst one I've heard so far because <laughs> not only are you sinning, right, but then you are sitting in your sin. <laughs> oh, like I'm stewing in uh, sin. Yeah, you know that yeah. post nut like you jeers and you're like, oh, yeah. what a mess of a person I am. Yeah. This person has just. Oh, I'm gonna take all of this in. Let it dr let it dry. How long, roughly, would it take for a big load to completely dry to the point where you can pick it off like PVA? Fuck That's me. a while. Yeah, you are sick, my it child. It depends on the consistency, but but don't worry. This is confidential. We are in the confession box, and we cannot, yeah. you know, tell anyone yeah. about this. Is you know, this is between us. But um, that is wrong, and you should know that is wrong. It's it's kind of wrong. What kind do you do with the peelings? That's a, this, all of these all of these confessions just leave me with more questions. Yeah. It's not enough. I think we should I think if we continue to be uh have the confession box, the mm -hmm. free skills confession box. I think what we should do is we should have live callers. That would so be awesome. Who can, uh, would like to do that? that? I don't know how good. we could set that it up. Would be very if you're enjoying this setup Discord, so far, maybe. But yeah, maybe that could work. It we, might work we, in the future. We, we could set that DSLR up to that laptop, live stream from the DSLR, have all this sorted as well, yeah. and take calls on Twitch. Well, maybe that's something for the future then, that? people. I'd do that. Yeah. Because we need because so many of these confessions, I just have more questions. There's I need to know the whole. I need to know the questions. whole story. You know. So um, another another confession, please. But, uh, I'll absolve you of that one. Yeah. That's fine. It, it, I, I, I can't remember in the Ten Commandments anywhere about being Thou shall not sitting let... in your own jizz yeah. for long enough. I don't think that's in there. No, no but it's it's, right. it's kind of one of those, like, I think that's just, like, a given. Like, we all know not to yeah. do Don't Don't I sit, mean, atheists, don't sit atheists in your jizz. Do that. No, clean out I certainly wouldn't do that, just because it's clean out gross. Out. I think it's a bit strange. It's, but I think there's nothing wrong with that in some ways. It's like... There's that, everything wrong with that, Greg. If that's what you're into, Father Greg, that's what you you're just into. Said, it's a bit strange, but I see nothing wrong with that. <laughs> yeah, but there's, there's a difference between something being strange and wrong. Yeah, wrong anything. is like Good wrong arguments. is like killing someone. Strange is like the Ripley's Believe It or Not book. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's exactly it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I got you. There you go. Right. So, uh, yeah, let's, forgive let's my child, but uh, no more of that. <laughs> I kicked in two heavy wooden doors in a Southampton pub toilet because I kept getting stuck in and panicking. Not realizing they opened inwards. I may know you? this person. I've this... seen a few people kick a few doors off. In, was this but, you, but, was... No, this wasn't. Sure? No. So oh, I do not. Is. I do not. I think everyone's done something bad in bars. a Southampton pub. Yeah. I've. I, I. I'm banned from quite a few pubs for drug, drugs. Drug, Father Greg. Drug possession. Do you mean Greg or Father Greg? Father Greg. Father Greg is you've done drugs father greg and greg are not two no, well this is things. another thing i don't think there's anything in the bible talking about drugs and let's be honest burning bush <laughs> you know what? He's, jesus, probably, Je he's probably right jesus turned been... jesus turned into a drug he turned into wine alcohol is the worst drug uh, uh, in well, okay, it's probably not as bad. You know what's heroin, really annoying about bad. him is that he consistently makes good points. That I do. I, can't I, I, I argue just, with. The thing is, is that I know you could argue with him if you knew more about the man. Him. The man poured wine and said, "This is my blood." I think I suffer a from drug. like a a condition where Jesus I have like is a drug. I have such clear common sense. <laughs> like my common sense is so cute that no one can argue that's, that's against it. That's because uh, the the best part of God is channeling in through exactly. your brain. Exactly. That's why I'm the Holy Spirit. Well, it, that that just means you pray the most. Yeah. Out of us, I do pray. We should pray yeah. more. We should pray more. What was the uh, question again, Father Greg? I've uh, forgotten. Well, kicking in a door at a pub because you didn't realize. Uh, you're absolved. Yeah, Everyone it's... gets a little bit angry, especially if you you've had some. Of, a, you've drunk um, a couple of Jesuses. There's a bit a part of the Bible where. Uh, where Jesus flips a table. There's also a part of the Bible where Jesus curses a fig tree. Yeah, so Jesus had a temper too. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah he, he, Jesus flips tables. Yeah. He, he curses fig trees. And also you were panicking, you know. Yeah. And, and God gave us panic response for a reason. Yeah. Mm. To escape danger. It you, could be, could something bad could have happened. Yeah. If you hadn't kicked that. You don't know. You don't we know. absolve you. 
Father you are Greg, absolved. The Holy Trinity. Okay. I have another confession here for my fellow fathers. Um, I told my partner I was on the pill because I was unable to have a baby. It's okay now, though, because he loves the boys and wouldn't have it any other way. So she tricked him into having kids. Legally, I think that's not very good. But no, I will say this. It's quite morally questionable, isn't it? It is. But uh, that, that actually might be some kind of deception thing. But... That, yeah. As fathers, as father Matt, father Lewis, father Greg, it's good that you did that because I mean, well, we need more children. Well, she did. She did but start. She did start it off by the, saying that person. she it was because she because I was unable to have a baby. So this person was obviously under the. They didn't just deceive this person. They were obviously under conception. I can't have children. Yeah. So I'll just say I'm on the. That does happen. Yeah, know. and, and if, a, if a guy is dumb enough to fall for that, <laughs> maybe he deserved to have a kid. Yeah, but if well, he, he says he's happy. He's if, happy and yeah, wouldn't change it. Yeah. So, well, I mean... If you wouldn't change it... I think yeah. a lot of people don't realise that... That's not really like, a confession then, is it? Yeah. That maybe the lying part's the confession. I think most, yeah. most people I know that are like parents are like... A lot of them are like, I don't want to be a dad. No, but no now, parenthood but now, but, is planned But now anymore, they're like... No. None of them are. Now they wouldn't have any other way. You know what I mean? Mm. So... Yeah. I don't know. Not that. all of them. There's uh, There are a lot of people I know where... that. They don't have fathers. So they just don't care about them. They've got us. Mm. Yeah. We're, we're your, we're we're your, your we'll be your father. I'm your uh, daddy now. Father Matt, Father yeah. Greg, Father Lewis, we'll be there. Daddy for Greg. You. Yeah. <laughs> daddy Greggy. But you are you are forgiven, you are, my we child. We absolve you. Yeah. I, open uh, your open yeah. your heart and be honest. Or I think that, like that. that that might be I think an w- issue. If you were gonna wait for a guy. Uh, to say, yeah, I want kids. You're never having kids. You wait for a long so time. So it, it's, maybe it's the only way to have kids nowadays is to deceive the guy. A lot of the time, the camera cuts out for a reason. We usually get into a <laughs> into a thought process that's too h- hardcore for YouTube. Yeah, definitely. Okay, I have another confession here. for um... Confess, spy. So, um, one time when me and my girlfriend were doing it, uh, we didn't realise till after I finished that her cat was under the bed the whole time. He jumps on the bed while I'm still butt naked, laying from exhaustion, and comes towards me, and he licked my balls. Ah, okay. Um, uh, where's the strange. sin there? Well, yeah, there's no sin because animals don't have consciousness again. He didn't cut. Co- he didn't. You didn't coerce the cat into licking your nuts. Yeah. Like you didn't lather them in like you, you catnip. And was maybe it's the smell of fish. Yeah. Yeah. As long as it didn't. Um, Oh, as long as you didn't come dude. from it, <laughs> I think you're okay, dude. I, right, you bit, you guys have been licked by cats, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Not on my there. bollocks, not, though. Yeah. yeah, a cat's tongue is is not. Ooh. Yeah, it's oh. like the lightest sandpaper. I hadn't even thought about it's that. Wet until sandpaper. Well, it's kind of sandpaper, but it's it's like it's got little needles in it. It does. Yeah. It's like a cactus. It, have you seen, have yeah. You, yeah, yeah. It's like it's got loads of little like I claws think... in it. I that would feel it, horrible. Nah, it would feel horrible. But the thing is, is that like you're a dirty, dirty, I devious. I mean, stuff like this happens because cat, cats hide. All right, the amount of times you, I've had sex and a cat's just been in the room and you don't realise till afterwards. Uh, it's it's no thing. Uh, uh, it's just married sex. Ah, uh, yes, yes, of course. <laughs> Was this with your first or second wife? Uh yes. Well, my I had one wife because I don't believe in divorce but she oh yeah of course after she passed away (laughs) I became a vicar because of course I can't have a wife as a vicar is that a thing? I think Catholicism it is oh yeah no you know I'm not a dirty Protestant Catholic Catholicism Catholic my balls Catholic (laughs) that's so shit I love it Catholic my balls Catholic, nah, come on, that's amazing. Lewis, yeah. I don't think look, Father Lewis picked up on that. What was that? Sorry. Catholic my balls. Ah, uh, the Catholic my balls. The Catholic my balls. Catholic my balls. <laughs> right. Nice. This one's a pretty harsh one. I, I cheated on my boyfriend with my gay best friend, <laughs> who is a drag queen. It was the best sex I ever had, and he said it was his best. The thing about that is, Even if he had joke- sex with you, maybe he's not gay. Maybe. Maybe. Isn't I isn't the drag bi- the wrong bit isn't here? Bisexual the 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 term now for having one. Yeah, uh, like like you if you have sex with a woman, you're not gay, surely. I feel like I could. Because ha- if I had sex with a dude, that would mean I'm bi, surely. It would, I wouldn't be straight anymore because it'd be like, especially if I enjoyed it. 
they'd be like, well, I'm not gay anymore. Well, I'm not straight. Why labels? Because mm. mm. people love labels, man. Why do we need? They do. Labels? Everyone loves a label. Love a label. Just, you know, just bang whoever you want to bang and dress however hey, you want to yeah, dress. But the thing is, hey. she cheated. As long as you married, boy- and as long as you told your boyfriend, as long as it's legal, yeah. you better told yes. your boyfriend because yes. cheating's not cool, unless you tell them. In which case, it is cool. But you know, because then you're giving them like the opportunity to run away. Honesty is the key. It is it is important. And as long as you're honest with people, that thou yeah. shall be saved. There's, there was no marriage there, so I... We, oh, I yeah. Like we can't yeah. Really um, um, this. Hell. No, yeah, hell. you're definitely going to hell. Hell. You're going to hell. Sorry about that one, but there's nothing we can do <laughs> for you there. Go to hell. There's too many red flags <laughs> in that to, uh, let you go to heaven. Floating toward... <laughs> <laughs> right, this one's just confused me. We'll I've, I've read this like later. twice, and I don't. Re- um, the truth is, I'm an ox. I think I may really got no feeling. Even be the Jesus of oxes. I've been even flowing for two weeks straight now. I can't sleep. I can't eat. I can't stop yeeting myself off my skateboard into the sunset. My tea poses are pretty lit, though. Even now, I will say one thing. Um, that meme of uh, Jesus. So good. Uh, I think it's a little bit sinful. Doing, I don't think it is. I think I think it's a modern way of sharing the religion. Yeah, yes. but surely there's something about God's image Christ, and yeah. using God's image in. Vein or I don't something. think it's using it in vain. It's using it in in, in, a, in It made him look pretty cool. Yeah. You got to think, right? How do we get the kids? This is what I'm about yeah. to say. The, the times are the times they are a changing. Yeah. You know, we got to, we have got to get the kids involved, and the kids yeah. like the TikToks, yeah, and they, they do like love the and they like the memes. They like memes. So we've got to you know put Jesus into those, but not in a way that is. Uh, you, you know, I, silly. I, yeah. And I believe those skateboarding memes are it's very. A, it's a good way of doing it. It's a, yeah. It's, it's healthy. It's, it's it's something funny that's clean. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yes. Sure Christ there. We do love Christ. Christ air. The thing is, is that I feel like. Is that like, like air? Is that like Nike kids, air? Kids yeah, aren't interested. <laughs> kids aren't interested in some smelly little shepherd from two thousand years ago. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? They're just not interested in that. What they are interested in is skateboards and TikToks. <laughs> yeah. Smelly little shepherd. You're an idiot. I love you. <laughs> they are, they do like skateboards. Uh, and they do, do, I, I, they do like the Pearl Jams. It's reaching the kids. And that's Pearl, what matters. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm cool with that. I don't like you thinking you're an ox. I think that's a bit weird. Yeah, the ox thing was yeah. strange. But the skateboarding stuff, keep that up, man. You yeah. are spreading the, the, wor- the, the word of the Lord. The word of in... Jesus himself. Yeah. Hey, did you guys like to come out of the thing at the moment? Did, did you guys see the edits I made of me doing the even flow shit? No. Have you not seen it? Did you not see it? Have you seen it, Greg? What do you think? <laughs> phone edits, put it up phone now? edits are Should so one crazy now? now. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah, it, they're, they're phone pretty cool. video editing is it's nutty what yeah, you can do. Yeah. It took me two minutes. To do even that. the way that even everything with a phone, like even the camera. Yeah. Like it's, it's bonkers. The fact that all the new they all shoot in like 4K and stuff. Mm. It's like you remember how There's like movies coming out now that have solely been filmed on. Yeah, iPhones. you remember how really? like when camera phones were first a thing and yeah. that just completely overnight yeah. wiped out the disposable yeah, camera yeah. market you don't need a disposable camera anymore i've got a camera on my fucking phone They're gone how long until like camera. how long until proper you know d- i mean obviously that there, there's certain things that you can't you won't ever really be able to do on a phone image wise that you can do with like a fucking mega movie don't blockbuster camera. yeah, yeah. sorry father but um but yeah, I. How much longer will it be until like the phones wipe out like the normal like DSLR market and cameras and stuff? Because there's phones now that shoot it's way coming. better than yeah, yeah. coming. Than, yeah, you know yeah. cameras that you can get for hundreds and hundreds of pounds, mm. like even close to the thousands. Do you know what I mean? It's but wild. a phone you can just 4K, it, uh, do, 60 uh, do frames. Do you guys remember? Uh, do you guys remember? Maybe about six years ago, there was a big thing about don't fucking film Berkeley. Ver- vertically. vertically vertically yeah 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 don't fucking film vertically this video Why? would have been amazing if you didn't fucking film it oh, sorry i'm using oh it, right i see what you film mean film it vertically yeah what and what's now... the problem with filming vert vertic- hang on well, well hang this is on. before like vines and tiktoks so yeah it, it, you mean would... landscape no, no don't film vertically don't so, film so don't film this way 
Oh, sorry. Hello. Whoa. Don't, don't film that way. Yeah. Film that way. Yeah. So lands landscape. Yeah, I only know landscape portrait. When portrait, you said vertically, right. it threw my portrait, head a little bit. Yeah. 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 yeah, that's been a thing for fucking ages. Like, yeah. like, and now look how everyone, long, long everyone records so it can fit on reels and yeah. shorts and TikTok. You now have to actually have to. Yeah. That's the Go out thing. Of your way like, to do it. Yeah. yeah. Even when we're filming on a weird? camera, we have to, when yeah. we make the reels, we have to make it yeah. phone sized. Yeah. yeah. Bonkers, yeah. isn't it? It's annoying. Crazy. Funny. I wish we didn't have to do that. But anyway, yeah, just father. It is. Father. Smelly little shepherd. Yeah. Smelly little shepherds. I once stopped midway through sex with a girl I had prearranged to meet in a travel lodge. Classic. I didn't say that. It says classic in the in the confession. <laughs> I had classic. 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 I had. To, I lost my virginity in a Holiday Inn Express. Really? Yeah. Hotel, we motel, married. Holiday Inn Express. I think um, I, I think I lost my virginity in Matt's bed. Yeah, but we had it in old. Yeah, I think you did. Yeah, in Matt's like, in his there. bed. <laughs> I, it was like it was I, me. I, I, like, had a, like a house party and my room. I, I let lent my room to one of my mates or something. Yeah. So that was the only bed available. Yeah. Got to go where you got to go. I lost, go. I, lost, I lost my virginity to my wife. Oh yeah. We did yeah. it on her bedroom floor under fairy lights. Oh, that's quite cute. Oh, wow. It was. That's pretty cute. It was amazing. Even kind, of, even kind, of, even. kind of, kind of, yeah. Uh, okay, yeah, so uh, Matey had prearranged to meet this uh, lovely lady in a travel lodge. Uh, I had classic. I had to stop because the travel lodge's lovely, clean white bed sheets uh, suddenly had a little brown stain where she was just sat. I noticed it and I couldn't continue. I left immediately. Um... Pussy or morally, pussy, absolute I pussy. understand why you feel bad morally for leaving this girl, but in uh, terms of sin, I don't think you've really committed any sins. Premarital there. sex. Yeah, but he didn't do it. He left. Oh, okay. He, left. he it, was going to do it. It was in his mind. He was maybe in his mind. He thought about maybe when he saw that shit stain and thought, no. I need to be married with this. With this, young yeah, lady. maybe, but that's probably not what happened. I mean, you know when. <laughs> Maybe, but that's not what happened. Nah, nah I don't. You know how that. people see Jesus's image in like wall cavities and pieces of toast and things. Yeah. Maybe on this shit stain, he saw. <laughs> Mate, like the thing is, is that... like, I've got, I've got <laughs> to change my ways. T posing Jesus yeah. shit stain. I, I, I think honestly, stink. it's the best policy. What he should have done is just gone up to her and go, "You've, you've made a shit stain. Go <laughs> clean your butt off. <laughs> Wash it. Have you washed your ass no, today?" But what we were saying is, Lewis said. That he saw Jesus in the shit stain. In the stain. Oh, in the stain. Yeah. yeah. You know like how like people yeah. see like, oh, call the call Reuters. Oh, there's fucking Jesus's face Jesus is, is on my front lawn. Yeah. yeah. Like. Oh, imagine that. Yeah. You you just come back in the room. There's a shit stain, but Jesus staring you in the face. It's, it's yeah. He's looking Jesus at you and he's like, stain. and you can smell him. You, oh. And, and you can just hear. It's the Holy Spirit. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Holy Spirit. <laughs> <laughs> Talks like Mr. Hanky. <laughs> uh, but yeah, um, I think you're, I think you're all right there, my child. Yeah. I think you, you, you realised you were doing wrong. You realised you couldn't continue, and you stepped back, and that yeah. takes great yeah. willpower. I would have, um, I would have continued. Yeah, a hundred percent. I would, I would not have bothered me. I just don't it care. Me just don't care about things. Yeah. Like that. I mean, if we're talking out, out character, I don't care. I really like. I would. I would literally. I would it's honestly. If that happened creepy. to me, I would just say you've put a shit stain. There. Yeah, you put a shit stain there. And and, 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 and then uh, put but, your own shit stain. But there. then I wouldn't so try to be. Feel nah, bad. I wouldn't. Try yeah. To, yeah. You don't want to yeah. embarrass them. You wanna. You wanna be like. It's fine. Look at the inside of my pants. Yeah. yeah. yeah you know. Check out these skids. Yeah. Hey, yeah. In fact, I'm about to go take a shit. Yeah, it's bad. Yeah. <laughs> I'll just be like, in fact, I'm about to go take a shit. You wanna come watch? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you know that's sinful. No, it's so not. now you know for next time, child. That's how you would deal with that. But I think you you dealt yeah. with that the best way that you you could under the circumstances. You did what you could. A lot of these Absolutely. are a lot of these are about hookups. Um, yeah. This one's pretty crazy. Uh, I was once hooking up with with someone in an Airbnb. Turns out that the owner was an OG racist uh, and kept golly dolls in the bedroom. So I wiped cum off my dick on it to fight racism. I think that's pretty commendable. I yeah. don't. I feel like uh, this person, instead of trying to stick it to the racist, just was racist in themselves and white faced a golly doll. Should have come oh, on the owner. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you come on the owner. No, what you should have done is gone downstairs, 
and they said, excuse me, but you've got some golly dolls up there, and I think that's mighty racist of you. Yeah. And then if they start kicking off, kill them. Yeah. <laughs> you, if someone come on one of my things... That's flashing. If someone come on one of my things, I would just... Come on my it. things. I just, Don't come on my things. The thing is, is that like... So if I come on you, that's, that's yours, yours, is it? it? Oh, well, God, if God. we're going back on what happened earlier about the cum drying up on that guy's belly, yeah. yeah? Same person. All maybe. that's going to happen is this woman's going to see, like, some glue on her golly doll and just wipe it off. And have... Glue. You're not fighting racism. You should have smashed those golly dolls or something. If yeah. that, that would be fighting racism. Yeah, if you Burn them fight little ra- fuckers. Uh, well, is it... Is... I don't know. Is what? Those, those things were everywhere, weren't they? Yeah, yeah they were massive. Yeah. They were, we, we, them. My mum told me she had one. Yeah, me, me and Matt used to uh, like the... volunteer in a charity shop yeah. and they had them there. Yeah, yeah. I remember yeah. quite recently, actually, near where I live. I um, Your voluntary work is good. I yeah. walked past this person's driveway that I walked past quite frequently because it's near my house. And they have a camper van on the on their driveway. And I always have a look at it because I'm quite interested. I'm in, I'm thinking about doing a, like a camper conversion thing. So I'm yeah, always like it. looking that's around cool. and like, oh, that's cool. And like the owner come out and she sort of smiled at me. And, yeah. and she yeah, opened she the door. In, she? No, but she opened the door just to get something out of it. Full of golly dolls. Really? Yeah, there were like 40 in there. And I was really? like, oh. They, they yeah. love them. Some people love them. I don't the, get the it. The type of person that that attracts are those people that cling on to like the old ways. I oh, should be allowed to have them because on, they make Britain great again. They're not racist. Yeah. Like, mm. yeah. I think they are. Yeah, like, they're, I'm pretty sure they're racist. Not only are they horrible and racist, but they're also just... Ugly. They're ugly. Yeah, they made them they're look stupid. purposely like dumb. ugly yeah. and horrible. Maybe some stupid, Barbies like... or something. Yeah. Have you seen that? I don't know if this is true because I read a, 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 a headline. You know what I'm like. I just read the headline. Yeah, yeah. But I think they made a Barbie that has scoliosis. Really? No, I think that's pretty cool. That's though. inclusive. That's very inclusive. And one in a wheelchair. The thing is, is that the only one problem with, with like, those no limbs. is that I don't know how well they'll sell. That would save a lot if they did just did bay up Barbies with no limbs. Well, limbless. Yeah, you little nugget Barbies. The old sad. Save a lot of plastic. Sad. I mean, you can do that yourself. Meat you can sad. do that yourself. Yeah, you're quite right. <clears throat> yeah, you can maim your own Barbie how you want it. Yeah. So why yeah. why are they selling purposely maimed but like well i guess because it's better that it just comes like that to show as opposed to you having to break it yourself to be like now it looks like you now that it's broken do you know what yeah. i mean <laughs> yeah that's that's not cool like yeah, i i like I the i like the inclusive yeah, do it. Right. I, I, um, I just, as I far as i'm aware the, the, the it's funny as far as I'm aware, fathers, I believe we've only got one confession left on this. Unless uh, you've no, it. I've got one here quick. Oh, yeah, go on. Uh, when I was five or six on a school field trip, I needed a pee, but couldn't be bothered to go to the toilet. Mm. So when I went down the slide in the playground, I accidentally peed myself. I didn't tell anyone and watched my classmates slide down, unintentionally using my pee like on a water slide. Yeah, oh. I like that. I think that's, I like that one too. that's good. I, Do you I, know, what? I have a very similar story that happened to me as a child. I remember, yes, I'd, Father Lewis. Yeah, I must have been just to let you know. This is what good reverends do. They share their own parts yeah, of true, experience true, to let you true. know. It's like addiction, um, people. I must have been like no older than like six, maybe yeah. seven at most. And I, I was playing on this climbing frame, and I was like desperate for a piss but you know when you're a kid and you just do weird stuff like why i didn't just go and have a piss and then come it was like, i don't want to miss out on like playing i'm having a good time yeah, so i'm yeah. like playing on top of this climbing frame or whatever and couldn't hold it like it's just piss and there was a kid under me on the on the climbing frame and he's like oh ooh, uh, ooh. and i was like uh Oh, I think I just panicked. Like, you know, you say dumb stuff as a kid. I'm like, yeah. oh, I think it's just started raining. Yeah. Like, I was saying all this, and he's like, ah, like, <laughs> sit off with you. It's like, coming out of my trousers, like, onto this dude's fucking head. Like, um, but yeah. I'm pitching. I think it, accidents happen. They do. Accidents they do happen. happen. They Especially happen a lot. As, as, as that young. They yeah. They're, they're, yeah. They're into the, they, they, they haven't been to church that many years. One thing I will say is that I think all of you guys, like, it's good that you you want to confess, but I think we need to stop feeling guilty about things that we did as really young yeah, children. Yeah, because yeah. I nearly said the I nearly said Jesus' name in vain then, but um, I did lots of weird, strange, yeah. terrible things as a child that I've suppressed 
over the years. Yeah, I can't imagine the amount of stuff that... I'm not even joking at this point. Like, yeah, so much out, stuff. Out of character. And every now and again, someone will say something to me and, wow. like, and it unlocks this memory and you're like, oh yeah. my God. I, I think for me, I, I, I feel so little guilt that like... <laughs> I just forget about everything mm. bad I did uh, as kid. I suppressed almost everything until yeah. the age of about 16. But if you guys... I don't remember any we, of school. I've just remembered yeah. something, actually, you saying that. When I was a child, mm. we're talking about masturbation and how it is a sin. It's a sin. It certainly is. The first time when I, I ever tried it was in a bathroom. Not you. By the way that you said a bathroom, I assume it wasn't yours. It was, yeah. It was okay. A family one. Okay. This this bathroom had a sharp plant by the front, by the door. And I was home from school, about 12, 13, whatever. And I was like, eh. Yeah. <laughs> I was in a bathroom, having a go, having a go. <laughs> As we said, having a go. We, we've, got, we've got to share our own stories yep. so okay. you, you feel better. And... My, I was home from school, tucking away. I was like, oh, oh, it's getting a bit, feel, oh, what's this shit? Yeah, and yeah. And just as I was about to jism, my mum came in through the front door and started running up the stairs going, Matthew, Matthew. And I ran towards the door because we didn't, the lock didn't work at the time. And I cut my knob oh. on the sharp plant by the, by the bathroom door, door. And I, and it was erect at the same time. Oh. You know what that is? That's that's God. That's a it was. Sign from telling, God. telling you. It was a sign from that's God. That's a sign from the Lord. Why do you think he designed sharp plants? To make at, sure. At dick height. Yeah. Yeah. It was. Yeah. It bled so much. Oh, oh, Jesus. And I couldn't tell her either. Yeah, too embarrassing. <laughs> I couldn't be like. It's far too embarrassing to yeah. tell you about Yeah, I've got a rock on. And it was frobber he's got we've got a on the podcast before code red we got a frobber frobbing yeah it's actually a genuinely new story rare that we have one of those yeah, yeah. we've pretty much said everything about our lives in there so. yeah then they're all really uneventful that's why we've crammed three people's lives into like 89 podcasts or something <laughs> yeah because yeah. that's how do we have dull a last one. I found, hang on, yeah, I've got one, and I believe it is the last one of the 25 that you sent. But don't worry, everybody, because we were inundated with yours. We just picked a random selection, but we are going to do more of these soon. And if you sent one in and it hasn't been read out, chances are we may read it out in another one of these, because I quite like this format. It's funny. I'm very happy with this format. I think yeah, this is good. And if you guys are enjoying this, please let us know, because I'd love to do more of these. Easy content. That's yeah, what I like. That's what I like to see. Good shit. Okay. Uh, last confession. I once slept with my geography teacher. Still couldn't find where to pleasure a woman, though. Actual true story as so well. So you is, were raped. This is yes, but it's it's well. It depends because he could have been learning. Around. He could have been learning geography at like university. So, so it's okay, a bloke, yeah, that's fair. That's, but we don't that's know. Boinkin, a female geography teacher. Mm-hmm. That's just wrong. again. We need more specifics because this it could is be the trouble. a uni. Uni yep. makes it e like better. Let's However, see. if you were eleven, yeah, then this is this is wrong. Even like fifteen, sixteen, man, that's still wrong. That's fucked up. But I think you're feeling guilt here, and I don't think you should because, to be honest, even if you were at university and you are that's of like, yeah. that's, that's if you're be... of like legal age, you're still a kid, you, aren't I you? I think you need to go to the police. That's, yes, uh, jog. That's yeah. Yeah, I don't really have much to say about that apart from I think I think you were raped. Yeah, yeah. I think that is actually really bad, man. Yeah. The thing is, I think a lot of guys, like especially when we're younger, it's like I had sex with the teacher. Dude, if I was fourteen and I uh, I yeah. got with the, I would have the, the, well, the, the French the teacher. French teacher. Um, <laughs> I I think I never even if it no. is legal, legally yeah considered, I would still just. I'd be fond about it, so I understand why. People yeah, I guess so. It's weird, less, isn't it? Less when it's guys. Yeah. Oh, it's, 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 it's it's so it's, fucked it's up. It's like, tricky, isn't there's it? There's just something like so animal-like in our brain that just yeah. yeah. It's still equally as bad. It's still fucked up. It's still fucked up. It's still really equally bad it's really under the law. Up. But like yeah. our brains are just wired in that way, aren't they? Like. Yeah. Like, it's just it's like you, that South Park episode where like um 
that kids like saying he's having sex with a teacher or whatever. Yeah. Oh, and what? Oi. And, uh, yeah. And all, right. all the police yeah. are just like, nice. 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 Yeah. yeah. That is the most. I love, that's what I love about South Park. It's so true. Yeah. That is exactly the response. Like, They're so good at South Park. so good example, at bringing up I, real yeah. world issues. If I was at the pub, like, yeah, and I nice. said to a bunch of mates, I was like, yeah, when I was like 13, I had sex with like the teacher. Everyone would be like, nice. Yeah. Nice. yeah. yeah. It's just men are weird. We're weird. Yeah. We're weird. We're fucked yeah. up. It was mm. really fucked it's up. It's not legally as, as bad. I, I, really I, bad. I, I do see sometimes about teachers, because it seems like so rare that it is a big story when it does happen yeah like teachers yeah coming out but you know if if you look back at it fondly it's still illegal and the geography teacher shouldn't have done it but it's the a thing single, is, yeah. it, it's her yeah. confession yeah yeah that's, that's whether you enjoyed confession. it whether you is, enjoyed it or not that teacher took advantage she, yeah, of she you she knows that you're a vulnerable kid that really wants to get laid we still don't yeah. know yeah. the ages oh no yeah. but even then, there's still a power dynamic. There is. No one power, studies geography at dynamic. university, do they? Does anyone do that? What are you studying geography nah, for? No, geography's not really a. I'm gonna I'm really... gonna assume that this was like secondary school, so you were yeah, you were probably thing. like fifteen. No, it's b- not infants, between yeah. fifteen yeah. and not seventeen. Be infants. Oh yeah. Who le- you don't it know? To, he had, had sex, so it has to be. I a imagine point it's where either secondary or get it up. Yeah. Mm. So either secondary school or college. Because yeah. there's not really uni geography courses, from what I know. Yeah, he's probably between like 15 and 17, yeah. somewhere around that bracket. We probably made this yeah. guy feel even more guilt reading we, this out. No, 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 this is not what we're here for. No. This man should not feel guilty at all, the and we want is, him to know yeah. that he should not feel guilty. You were taken advantage of, sir. And it's never too late to and, go to the police. But is this no. a confession of like, hey, I, hey, I did this? Or well, like, he didn't yeah. see something in the... happened to me, but I, I don't know. know. If I it's feel like he is boasting a bit. I think about it's a boast. There were laughing, the there were laughing faces in the uh, yeah. In see, the he, so he looks back on this as like a good thing. Yeah, but he shouldn't really. But you, you, yeah, but I would. Yeah, I know, and I agree. I would too, but we shouldn't look back. Specific like teacher. Yeah. Well, we don't know. You know who exactly exactly We don't know if it's is. an attractive teacher. Oh, what teacher. for you? T- yeah. Oh okay. man. But, yeah, but the the, the other issue I think it's is in between that... this thing. Sorry, Greg. Yeah. I think it's in between this thing, which is. But the yeah, other... they're a woman, and yeah. they're in there. You see them yeah. every like day. 14. But the other yeah. thing we need to think about is that if she's done this to one student, she's yeah. probably done it to several. That's true. I did. I actually heard rumors about my geography teacher doing the same thing, but it was. Nah, he girl. was cool as fuck, man. He he would have never done that. He was like cool dude. I'm just telling you that that's right, mate, what I was told. He kept me behind on my last day. Yeah, of I'm sure he did. He kept you behind, mate. He loves yeah. you. Nah, he was a nice guy. Off. I really like that guy. He kept me behind on my last day of school to do my coursework, and I got an A. So fucking hell. I, I owe him. He's yeah. He's what did cool you dude. do to get an A? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I will not have any slander about him. Sinner. He, I got on with him loads. He was really nice. No, to he me. was quite nice. He, was really he, cool. he tried very hard with me, and I was just class clown i just couldn't and I just yeah couldn't yeah. yeah it's, it's but I, I, geography it? is one i did get a b in so it's not like yeah yeah i didn't even take geography no that's the thing though is that like i love volcanoes mate i love them yeah it's interesting isn't it, it isn't the planet amazing it hasn't god provided us with something god has provided so, us with so amazing quite but amazing what planet. do we do all day Masturbate. Destroy Work. and jizz and shit all over his beautiful creation Premarital sex yeah and, yeah. Uh, not enjoy the natures that are, uh, we, we we take it for granted. We take it for granted. No wonder he's pissed, and he keeps giving us all these diseases yeah, and man. obstacles to get it's around. Like fucking have COVID and stay inside. Yeah, you like, got stop. You stay inside yeah. all, the time, all the time. Nah, anyway. nah, because tra- you guys need a timeout. Co- COVID came yeah, from so China. COVID is a timeout. And Chinese are atheists. So, uh, what is the church's position on where? the virus came from it was man-made obviously by the chinese atheists to destroy us it's the chinese atheist virus and please we have we have to even fucking say that we're joking about that but you can say it now you are allowed to say no it's a lab leak we give a warning at the start but another warning again that this entire podcast well they are atheist they are atheists i think a lot of them are they some of them i don't don't really know yeah they're weird I feel like now you can't make generalization guesses on things. It has to be no, like, none. you don't know everything. But yeah. I'm just going to say this, all right? Even though I mean, statistics I are a thing that we should yeah. all be I'm able to go sure off I'm pretty sure the government like, is, at least. This, the, the people that go around every single fucking day and they say, you're stupid, you're this, you're that. Mate, what the fuck are you without your phone? You sit there and Google it. What the fuck are you without your phone? 
have you have you done politics? Have you done mm. five years in university? No, you've read some tweets. Shut the fuck up. And the thing man, with no. googling stuff now as well. Me off. Is Shut that... up. You're not more clever than me. You've heard it here first. <laughs> I'm there more clever than you. I the thing. It's hard. Like, it's hard knowing what to trust anymore these days because on any argument, right, about anything, if you're one side or another, and you go on Google. If you find, if you look for stuff against your point, you'll find hundreds yeah. of forums and articles about why that thing is wrong and this and that. And the fact. But then if you so Google it in a new. slightly different way that is in favor of yeah. it, you're going to find that stuff. It's, it's so it's, you know, the Internet can't really be tr- trusted for no. any forming any kind of sort of opinion on anything, really. Really, nothing can be. No. Yeah, you got to get out in that open world and make yeah, you can't... informed decisions for yourself. So don't call other people stupid. No, no, nah, call everyone you else would stupid. Not, you wouldn't have any intelligence if you didn't have a phone in your hand. By the way, we I love, was only we love shouting you, into this microphone and getting angry just to check the audio levels. Yeah, please let please right. let what us know. Fuck? Please let us know uh, as well at home how the audio sounds. Um, We're going to be tweaking it over the next yeah, few weeks. This yeah, this is a long old setup. You can't see of if you're listening right now, you won't be able to see anyway. But if you're watching, you won't see right now. No. The the wires on the floor, it looks fucking mental. It looks like yeah. spaghetti junction down it's there. Like jellyfish. Like, it's crazy. Um, yeah. So it was it was quite hard setting this up, but we're going to do some tweaking. Hopefully, a few more of these will be on it. We're going to get the audio sound in as crisp and as perfect as we possibly can. Yes. And um and yeah. We might even but... export as WAV file. Mm, never know. Really? You want to do WAV? You want to WAV it? Should we WAV everyone goodbye? We, I think we should WAV off. Should we WAV everyone away? Uh, now, uh, one of you can go find the Patreon subscribers. We've waffled enough. Yes, off. I'll do that now. The Patreons are Medicated Gaming with Dabbing Dave. Oh, Dab. Yeah. This one is amazing. Lame. Smashable Grave. Okay, that, that is like smashable, that grave. smashable yeah, grave. Yeah, I like that. That's Dredge, good. the MCR Charlotte, okay. Moxa King. I love you, Moxa. Sandwich. Uh, George, Kaylee, Martin Sanford, Cray Green, Aiden Blue, and Lewis RMJ. All very familiar names yeah. to me. Yeah. We love you very much. Thank you for your continued support, even yeah. after like the two. To three months that we were away yeah i know Plus, i don't blame anybody that sorry, i do not blame anybody that had subscribed yeah. and then unsubscribed i yes. completely understand and if you're still watching and you felt like oh i just can't pay for this that is more than fine yeah, we do understand what do. do what you do your thing but um even though but, at the start we were saying put the money in the pot otherwise you, you better put yeah. them yeah, yeah but that's that's because we're trying to save them from hell mm. yes well, you're more than welcome to not put that money in that pot but just you just know that you, you won't be getting through them pearly burning. gates. Yeah. Who is it that stands at the pearly gates? Saying, is it Matthew? Some, yes. Someone stands. Whoever's there, you, you ain't on the guest list. Matthew, Mark, Luke. You ain't Dolan. getting in. So, you know, donate. Subscribe to the Patreon. We love you very much. I hope you enjoy this new setup. I hope mm. it sounds very nice. And I hope that, you know, we might be doing more uh, sort of dressed up, themed yeah things because there are some i've got in yeah i haven't i like this setup i feel like in in all honesty i feel like with the podcast i love doing the podcast with you boys but i feel like it did need something fresh i don't it needed a new i don't know if there's been enough people if there's been a i don't know if there's a podcast that is ad-libbed characters the, the whole time see that's you know perfect Right I like this of kind of setup. It keeps you on track a little bit more because yeah. I think that's our problem, the losing track. and just Whereas this kept us kind of shoehorned into a, you know, but we could still tangent off occasionally. You're but I, I think I think it worked nicely. So, yeah, please, I am really curious. Please let us know, guys, if you did like this setup, if you enjoyed it, if you'd like to see more stuff like this, more of these confession things because I've really enjoyed today. I think it's been good. Yeah. It's so, been um, all right. But, yeah. And we, 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 we can help confessions dressed as other things. Maybe not religions, though. Mm. Yeah. yeah. I don't want to do any more monks. religion bashing. Did I tell you about... We, how love, I, we love you, Christians. Did I tell you about you my experience with a monk the other day? No. Did but I'll you tell can you about on this. the next podcast. I'll tell you about my experience with a monk. monk. It wasn't really okay. that interesting. Monk. But I met a monk. A real monk. Does it, does it involve spunk? No. <laughs> 
like this podcast. <sighs> yeah. We used to say 100 likes. Get us to 50. It's not that hard. Oh, oh come on. 50. That's even, nothing e- to ask for. Even 75. 10 would be nice. We've just absolved you all of yeah. your disgusting, devious, yeah. foul. Wait, just before we go, what was the worst one? Um, the, the, uh, I can't remember them all. The, the, the killing a dog was quite bad. Yeah, killing dogs. But it was an accident. Yeah, great thing. And it's just an accident. Any of the, accidents happen. Any of the jizz related ones. No, jizz related ones were probably the least worst because it's, it's just jizz isn't it? Yeah, you're not hurting anyone. Um, else. I don't know. I think the cheating one's pretty bad. Um, oh, I yeah. think the, uh, the, adultery. Kill it, killing a mm. uh, fish with a fucking tenderizer mallet. I forgot about that. Probably the worst. I have yeah. to say. Just if you're doing that just makes you a bad just person. for fun. Yeah. I mean they're literally alive and you're tenderizing them while they're alive. It's yeah. fucked up. Yeah. Yeah, that was quite bad. Yeah. I can't um, remember if we forgave you or not, but we probably shouldn't have. We well, we, forgive I, we you definitely all. did forgive you. God forgives and, all. And, can't and we hope that. that you forgive us for that absolute trash. Mm. Now yes, thank take you. care of yourselves, we love you very much. Bye bye. Peace out. Riskins out. Holy Trinity. Father Matt, Father. Lewis. Lewis. Oh, I thought you were pointing at Greg. Father. Father Lewis. Father. Son. Oh, yes. Father. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Right. I'm on it now. Go on. Father. Son. The Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. One more time. Oh, no. One more time. One more time. We've got to get it right. You just do Amen. What was wrong with that one? No, again. You do it at the same time. Next time, let's go. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Oh, that there was so lame. No, no, that's good. <laughs> no, that's kind of the start. <laughs> <laughs> right, guy. Bye, bye.